Factory for Tomorrow is our approach to inventing the factory of the future. It's an innovative factory, a prototype for Scheffler's factories of the future. We wanted to respond to current megatrends, digitalization, demographic change, industry 4.0, and make our factories fit for the future. The project was started against the backdrop that we're regularly building two factories a year somewhere in the world. And it was logical for us to ask the question, what will a factory of the future actually look like? Representatives of the regions, divisions and functions were involved in the project from the beginning. It can be said that everyone's opinions and ideas have been taken into account, from the operator to the executive board. We drew a lot of pictures simply to put our ideas down on paper. We then illustrated these ideas in an overall concept in order to show all the solutions in relation to each other. During the current stage, we are focusing on implementing the findings gained in a comprehensive pilot at the Xiangtan campus in order to build our first factory for tomorrow. Of course, we have a great deal of experience thanks to numerous factory planning projects. Nonetheless, we were very happy to get an external perspective that gave us new ideas and suggestions. Our topics include everything associated with work, regardless of whether this is development, research, management or production. We had a number of objectives. At this point, I would say the most important objective, and this is the remarkable thing about this project, is to bring people together. We've defined the modules that we are working on and linked these modules in a diagram. We then transferred this diagram to the site and developed it into the actual overall layout, the master plan for the location. A central element of this project is to increase the attractiveness of factories. This includes improved communication in particular. Everyone should feel part of the location and be able to communicate with each other, so that we create as many synergies and as much collective intelligence as possible. The two most important developments are the central building and the spine, which forms the backbone of the entire campus. The idea of the butterfly concept is that we have four halls, which are our wings, and the body in the center, which accommodates the corporate functions that serve the wings. We also have the streams from the wings that flow towards the center, towards the body. This arrangement makes it possible for people to meet and exchange ideas more regularly, and also ensures increased communication on campus. Everyone goes through one entrance, regardless of whether they are white-collar or blue-collar workers. You go up the stairs, the canteen is over there, and you can go to the office areas or to manufacturing. Everyone has a common gateway. The creation of spaces in which people can meet is a significant aspect for promoting communication. We worked with a Feng Shui consultant during the design of the campus. We commissioned an expert, Professor Hu, in China in order to adjust to the local culture. This had a major effect on the project. For example, we constructed the main entrance for personnel on the south side. This is because of the Xiangjiang River, which flows past Xiangtan. The river radiates energy that we must bundle. This energy must be channeled to the right locations. We have created an opening that allows the energy to flow in and be redirected to the center of the building where it can be used to stimulate activities. To design the factory in an attractive manner for our employees, we placed great emphasis on the ability to see outside from every point in the factory. This ensures there is a high proportion of natural light in the factory. 
Large continuous areas, which can be used flexibly and to maximum effect, because today it is unclear what we will be producing there in 10 or 30 years. A standardized supply grid enables us to connect machines to the mains quickly and simply. I'm very pleased that we have achieved this result. This project was definitely worthwhile because we also want to transfer this concept to all existing plants and new plant buildings.